right so this is how I'm running it at the moment two case fans blown to the back um, at the moment it's around 32 degrees 30 degrees in the room which is can't remember how much in Fahrenheit this is so it's doing 52.4 I think it's about 90 odd watts uh, there you go temperature is 60 junction is 98 most is 100 degrees Celsius yeah so no air conditioning on at the moment so I'm going to change the uh, the pads and the firm pace and we'll see what happens and place it back in the same position gonna give it a quick clean with this air duster uh, pads wise yep got these two uh, 1.5 and 2 hopefully they'll work um, conductivity is 12.8 and got this thermal paste as well there you go plastic on both sides Okay, so that's just a back plate. So there's two wires here. Should probably try and get out. Okay, let's uh, try and put this. Okay, so here's the. You can just see the, how much oil there is. In there, there is the GPU itself, and you can see all the oil. on here I won't point it out but here 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 and here maybe you can see that ah, there you go so I'll try and clean all that up try and clean this part up um, the wires I actually can't take off so I might not do that but there are uh, oil on here as well. What I discovered with these two modules, uh, I guess you can say this is the top section of it. This is a memory module, right? And there's oil on here. And this stuff here is actually dust because it hangs out here I believe yeah so these two memory these two modules actually overhang out here which is why there's so much dust on it so I'm not even sure how to cool those down maybe maybe cut a little pad that is extends beyond here just trying to clean this up now uh, Bits of tissue.
it's all cleaned. Uh, took ages, but um, I'm not sure what's going to happen. But if you guys do this, just be really careful with the oil. As you can see from this side, some of the oil actually got onto the motherboard. I tried to use um, earbuds to to sort soak it up, but of course it gets pushed down. So I'm not sure what's going to happen. Um, and yeah, that's my dog crying. I don't know why. Uh, that's the. That's the thermal pads from the original thermal pads. Get it, guys. Clean it all up. So now I'm just gonna measure this and um, put them on here. So, uh, naturally, I forgot to video the reassembly of the GPU. Um, anyway, I had planned to use this 2mm on the back of this, i.e. in between this plate and the back of the memory um, uh, modules. Uh, but then I figured out this has grooves in it, so if I'm using the case fan, then I, there's not much point of me putting this in between the back of the memory module and where the air is going in. If this was a solid plate then I would but because there's tons of grooves on it actually the heat dissipation is better with the case fan and uh, I just started it and the contrast is amazing it's uh, about 18 degrees Celsius difference. I'll show you now. Uh, so it's nearly 32 degrees in the room because the air conditioning is off and the room is a complete mess. But let's have a look. I'll show you now. Um, oops, sorry. So 5700. Um, GPU zero is the fifty seven hundred uh, non XT sorry fifty two point four same as before uh, no change to the uh, settings so it's still fourteen hundred core eighteen fifty memory I haven't bumped that up yet and forty minus forty percent and the power and this is the difference um, so GPU temperature is about the same as before 60 but the memory junction temperature is 80 82 I'll leave it to run overnight but usually when I have this on uh, usually it climbs straight up to 96-ish, so there's a massive difference. Hey, morning everyone. So, it's been running for, uh, let's have a look, 8 hours and 24 minutes. Uh, GPU 0 is still at 52.4. There you go. Uh, junction memory is 82, junction 68, uh, edge is 61, which is basically, if you have a look here, nope, not the 3070, sorry. There you go. Same settings, hardware info, 84, actually just jumped to 84 now. 82. So yeah, overall I think it's a success. So tempted to 
we have my 3080 which also runs a memory junction of uh, 98 200 but then the problem is I'll void the warranty anyway thanks guys for watching I uh, hope you liked the video um, the process wasn't that hard actually just make sure you clean your hands free of oil uh, the cutting bit was a little bit hard but you don't exactly have to follow the exact uh, strips from the GPU um, you could cut it into blocks like I did um, it just takes more time and uh, remember please to peel both sides of the plastic off if you do it uh, so yeah so from basically 100 degrees Celsius memory junction down to 82 but this GPU my 5700 I purchased it second hand uh, it's non modded uh, non BIOS modded and it's probably he said warranty was over so more than I'm assuming more than three years or two years anyway um, thanks for watching uh, please comment uh, likes dislikes and let me know what other videos I can do thank you